Famous for its world-renowned music, historic architecture and vibrant nightlife, New Orleans is a great place to spend a long weekend. This is Katie and in this New Orleans City Guide, we are sharing the best things to see and do in the lively city, plus when to visit, where to stay and most importantly, what to eat in New Orleans. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure you hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. First of all, let's talk about when to visit. One reason that many people flock to New Orleans is for the Mardi Gras celebrations, which are in full swing from February to May, when the weather is comfortable and cool. If you are looking for a quieter experience, however, visit the city in December or January. The cheapest time of the year to visit is during the summer months, but expect an average temperature of 91 degrees Fahrenheit. It is also worth noting that hurricane season runs from June to November, with the worst months being August, September and October. Now let's talk about where to stay in New Orleans. If you only have a few days in the city, aim to stay in the French Quarter itself. Hotels here and on Bourbon Street are more expensive than most, but if you are travelling as a group, this is a great place to stay. You are near all of the attractions and you don't have to commute around too much. Uptown and the Garden District are also great places to stay in New Orleans, as well as Lakeview and Lakewood. Downtown New Orleans is compact meaning it is easy to walk around from place to place. There are plenty of cabs available if you are looking to go further afield or use the New Orleans Regional Transport Authority for $1.25 streetcars and buses around the city. Many people head to New Orleans for its amazing food. Head to the popular Café du Monde for coffee and beignets and also try the po' boy sandwich, jambalaya and king cakes. There are plenty of things to do in New Orleans to keep you busy and here are just a few of some of the awesome attractions in the city. The first place you want to start at is the French Quarter. This is the oldest and most famous neighbourhood around that is everything you picture when you think of New Orleans. Walk over to the St. Louis Cathedral in the neighbourhood whilst appreciating the street performers in Jackson Square. As the night rolls around, head over to Bourbon Street for a party and food scene like no other. Another option for local nightlife is Mermini, where bands play until 4am in clubs such as the Spotted Cat, the Blue Nile and DBA. During the day, find some time to visit the National World War II Museum, a world-class museum of war materials, weapons, restored aircrafts and a 4D experience narrated by Tom Hanks. This is a moving experience and a must for those interested in world history. New Orleans is known for its Mardi Gras celebrations, but they also hold many other festivals throughout the year. Visit at the end of April to enjoy the Jazz and Heritage Festival, or head here in March for the Tennessee Williams Festival. Looking for some peace and quiet? Head to City Park and enjoy the 1,300 acres of greenery, as well as the nearby New Orleans Art Museum and Dueling Oaks. Jazz lovers should head to the New Orleans Jazz Museum, while shoppers should head to the Magazine Street for some colourful and unique boutiques, costume shops and spas. Garden District is another popular area to explore for its stately mansions, beautiful greenery and Lafayette Cemetery. Get out of the city and take a local wildlife tour around the southern Louisiana swamplands. You can't get so close to the Mississippi River without jumping on a steamboat. Steamboat Nanchez offers daily departures from New Orleans with day cruises sharing historic stories, whilst evening cruises including a live jazz band on board. 
have an incredible time in New Orleans and let us know what your favorite thing to do in the city is in the comments below. Take care and until next time, stay creative. Thank you.